My first question is why why the climate changes are so important for aviation in your opinion? Well, it is part of the global agenda yep. um, on how we fight climate change and uh, especially in Central Europe uh, there's a big concern and also a big emotional debate on uh, what aviation can contribute to fight climate change. I do know that um, the sector will develop, develop very, very dramatically. So I have no doubt in uh, big growth in aviation. But if we have this big growth, I think we have to responsibly act um, as a, a sustainable sector in the end. And innovation takes very long uh, in our sector. There are solutions like biofuel or sustainable fuel, but we have to start now because it takes such a long time and it costs such a huge amount of money. But aviation is responsible for only 2% of the global changes, and even if it doubles, it may be. 4%, but not, not so more. And, uh, yeah, that's true, but it uh, should not be used as an excuse. Yeah? It's, yeah. it's uh, the, the relative portion of this part of mobility will grow. Mm -hmm. um, and um, I think all industries, and now we are working in the aviation sector, um, they should responsibly act and um, be serious in their attempts to, uh, to become better, to become sustainable. Because otherwise, uh, I think that governments, maybe also supranational bodies, but especially governments, will start regulations to limit the yeah, development. Yeah. What do you think airports can do in terms of efficiency? Because you see, every if airport works as efficiently, then there is less, less uh, pollution than if uh, airports are staying and so on. Well, first, uh, at first, I think <coughs> you have to set up a mindset. Yeah? Yeah. that it is necessary when you do investments that there's also a climate part in these investments. Yeah, yeah. Um, your buildings that you build uh, should be very sufficient, your operations that you have, your um, maybe also your, uh, your charges policy should be related to yeah. emission and emission issues mm -hmm. um, and all these things. So many, many, many parts of actions um, that are possible. Um, but my experience is if your own management mm -hmm. um, does not believe, does not know, um, uh, does not have a program, then nothing will happen. Yes. And in the end, climate has no frontiers. Yeah? Yeah. It is a worldwide topic. Europe is one of the biggest markets. Uh, Europe has probably the most advanced mindset also already. So we should act. And governments, they're pushing us. Yeah? Yeah. So they're taxing aviation mm -hmm. now yeah. uh, for climate purposes. Uh, and we don't want to be uh, that our industry becomes uncompetitive. Yeah. So we are also urged to, in the end, then, um, show that we are serious in our climate efforts. Yeah, and to have a common position yeah. for airlines and airports. And That's the other point. Yeah. Airlines. I mean, the sector itself should act. Mm -hmm. um, of course, um, airlines in the end cause this big climate footprint because of their fossil fuel footprint. Mm -hmm. um, so um, the energy should be put in how, how do we get sustainable fuel as quickly as possible. Yeah. Technology is there, but we have to invest quite a lot. It's still very expensive. Uh, but we have to do the first step. Um, the, there are solutions. It's not impossible. We, uh, it takes money. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you cannot, uh, in the end, support a, a policy, a government policy yeah. that would um, out-tax airlines yeah, in the business. And the, the target should not be to make them uncompetitive. Um, so the talk with the governments is very, very necessary. Uh, don't overdo it. Uh, airlines need uh, a financial basis to invest in, in climate change. Airports themselves as well. 
So big airports that are profitable are much better off than smaller airports, which have in the end problems to, um, to do what in the end is needed. But the more uh, uh, organizations, industry partners are together, the better it is yeah. to address versus the governments what's the right way to do it. We have to be serious in our attempts. Mm -hmm. yeah. People have to believe us that we want to uh, do something uh, and uh, we have to start now because it takes a long yeah. time. It's a long and winding road and it will cost money. So there is no climate action for free. Yeah, it's also a question of mindset. <laughs> also, yeah, it's a question of mindset. What's, what's your opinion about this event? I, I, I mean this conference. I like to come here um, also because it's necessary that Russian organizations, that the Russian aviation sector keeps in touch with the Central European aviation sector mm -hmm. because we have to work together. It's always about best practices, about yes. better solutions. It's about also uh, setting the agenda. What are we discussing? Are we only discussing technological innovations? Or are we, are we discussing even bitter question, bigger questions like what's the future of the sector, where is, where is it going to go, Competi competition issues and all these things.